Initiating experiment. I will now crush this soda can and return it to its natural form. Otter, what kind of experiment are you up to this time? Are you trying to turn a soda can back into a rock? It's logical, is it not? The can is metal. Rocks are hard. Therefore, cans must come from rocks. Maybe we should ask an actual scientist before you start smashing more things. Hello, Nakira and Otto. This is Camille Batiste, a chemical engineer. I hear you're exploring aluminum. Let's take a closer look to see how this metal is truly formed. Yes, Otto thinks soda cans turn back into rocks. Is he onto something? Not quite. Aluminum comes from bauxite, which can be in the form of rocks or even soil that contain aluminum oxide. Bauxite is refined through a process called the Bayer process, where it is crushed, mixed with a chemical solution, and then heated to extract aluminum oxide. Then, through electrolysis, pure aluminum is separated and used for manufacturing. So, this soda can was once part of a mountain? Wow! Exactly! And recycling helps us use aluminum over and over again instead of digging up more. Every recycled can saves 95% of the energy needed to make new aluminum. Really? I promise to recycle you, buddy. That's so cool! What's another everyday thing that started off as a rock? There are so many. From glass to ceramics, many of our daily items come from the earth. Keep discovery! Isn't the earth so cool? I wonder what other things the earth gives us. Think about it. Know it, show it, own it. What everyday objects come from the earth? Just like my new can friend. Explore and learn more. What a fun adventure! Be sure to like and subscribe for more. See you soon!